First semester United States government and politics students participate in their full session. Some exciting changes at Glacier Creek. And district elementary schools celebrate and have a little fun. All this and more coming up on this edition of January in Review. Hello Middleton Cross Plains Area School District. I'm Noah. And I'm Erin. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to this month's In Review. All that January snow didn't slow down our district at all. This month was jam-packed with awards, debates, and a new semester. First semester United States government and politics students at Middleton High School participated in their full session on January 8th. The USGP class is a semester-long course that simulates our government's legislative process. Students discover and develop their own political views on current issues and events and write their own bills to propose and discuss to the rest of the student legislator. I've been in 70 countries, but the only one that I've been afraid to be killed by guns to be shot in the place that's supposed to be a safe learning environment is in the U.S. Yeah. 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 Their full session, held in the PAC, is where students debate and discuss which bills should pass and fail. This bill passes. <laughs> This full session is especially unique because they were visited by U.S. Senator Ron Johnson, who answered their many questions. <laughs> I bet you didn't know that. That's the way you get a result. Trying, you know, there are so many problems facing this nation. We discussed in our legislative semester has been man-made global climate change um, and how we can create legislation to combat it. 41 Middleton High School DECA members competed in their district competition at Sun Prairie High School on January 9th and were very successful. <laughs> students who finished within the top four of their series are named champions. Seven MHS students took home the gold that day, including the following. 14 students will move on to state in Lake Geneva in March. Congratulations are also in order for the following Spelling Bee finalists at the District Spelling Bee. Great job, guys. <laughs> and exciting new changes at Glacier Creek. Bill Dino is now the principal. Mr. Dino has been the associate principal of Cromrie Middle School for 11 years and started in his new position on the 18th. Eric Engel, a science teacher and dean of students at Cromrie, has filled Bill Dino's position as associate principal. We were lucky enough to ask Mr. Dino some questions. Can I get it out of the way? Hi, Mom. All right. So you are the new principal of Glacier Creek Middle School. I am. Were you hesitant to take the position? Did it take you a while to decide if you wanted to do it? I wouldn't say I was hesitant, but probably taken, you know, by surprise a little bit, but um, overall kind of honored that I would be asked and I would be given a chance to think about uh, all the different things that come with making a decision like that. So I've been really happy that I've made that choice. So it's been about two weeks, correct? About that. About two weeks? Yeah. So was it, is it what you expected? Do you like it? How is it? Yeah, um, I really like it. And uh, from uh, my initial impressions, um, I, I'm really pleased and um, I'm happy to be there and be part of that uh, group of people. So if you've been at Cromery for 11 years, is there anything that you miss at Cromery? Yeah, I, you know, I miss it. It's been part of my life. Um, you know, the kids that I work with, as long as they've been alive. So that's a long time, and, um, but it's, it's all good. So are you looking forward to anything specifically or just generally excited at Glacier Creek? Yeah, um, just looking forward to getting into a flow and um, getting into the summertime and then starting up and having a, an entire school year uh, that that entire period. All right. Well, thank you for being here, Mr. Dean. Yeah, not a problem. Hey, anytime. Uh, again, I like what you do, and oh, it's uh, it's a great resource <laughs> and service to the community. So thank I you. Although it's sad to see Mr. Dino go, he'll surely do well in his new position of principal at Glacier Creek. Sure will. <laughs> Elementary schools definitely had a fun month, too. 21 stellar students were honored at an assembly at Elm Lawn this month. This one is one of five each year, where, where they recognize students for showing exemplary character. This time it was for their self-control and generosity. So congratulations to all the honored students. Elm Lawn is lucky to have these students within their school. West Middleton had a rather exciting pep assembly on January 19th. 
Fun was had during the winter relay. Two students from each grade took a turn racing each other, getting dressed in winter clothing. Lots of laughs to warm up the school in the chilly weather. That's all for this month. But in February so far, we can look forward to Middleton Drama's performances of Peter and Wendy and The Winter's Tale. Yeah, we're in them too, so come on by. <laughs> Be sure to tune in next month for In Review and stay warm.